Hey guys, what's up? It's King here, and today we're playing another episode of Gunther Star 5. And before I get started, I want to tell you guys that I'm sorry for not really noticing the audio in the last video. I went to check the settings in GTA 5 and to see if they you know, they're too high or just to lower them so you guys can hear me more. And they were all the way up for some reason. I don't know why they were so high up. So I turned them back down. Hopefully you guys can hear me a lot more in this video. And if you do notice the subtitles were off in the beginning of the last video, those are those were turned back on in the middle of that video. Uh, now what I think happened is I think I accidentally pressed restore default or something and everything went back to normal. So everything's back to where I need it. I want it so you guys can hear me and also hear the game. So yeah. Anyways guys, before we get started, I want you guys to hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the post notifications, hit the share button, share this video with all your friends. So you guys can watch this video more in the future. Anyways, let's get right into it. So in this oh, in this episode, we are going to meet Lester. So let's do it. Fuck you, Lester. You gonna let me in or what? Give me a minute. I was wondering when you'd show up. I was dead. Praise be. Guess you weren't very dead. You need my help. How do you know? Because you came here. Worst. Why else would you? <clears throat> I haven't been a good friend for you, Lester. I know that. And you're going to make it up to me by doing whatever I ask. Or rather, I, I mean, I need something done. You need to know something. So why not help each other? I got to make some dough. So you're back in the game? I guess. Look, Lester. About what happened before. Oh, I know you never mentioned my name. I know I'm not on any lists anywhere. I know you never betrayed me. As for you, you gotta figure that I never told anyone. That instead of gently decomposing in North Yankton, you're angrily decomposing in Los Santos with a shrink and a wife who don't love you no more. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, <laughs> since you put it like that... Hey, shut up a minute. I'm getting an eye find alert. That little... College boy, sack of shit, phony fuck. Who? Jay Norris? Yes. That fuck is a lying bastard. I've read his fucking emails. He's a fucking cheat. Uh, I heard him say that he saved America. What, by, by outsourcing all the jobs? By selling us little bits of plastic restricted access shit? Well, now it's payback time, you lying turd. What the hell are you talking about? You are about to get that white collar gig that you always dreamed of, Mikey. Here. Take this uh, fashionably retro weird for a 45-year-old man, but I cannot let go of the 1980s bag and dress yourself up like a billionaire math genius with low-level Asperger's. You better be ready for the minor glitch of your repulsive pseudo-messianic life. Okay, Lester. Get out of here! Call me when you're ready. We are about to put the Darwinism back in social Darwinism, and brother, it is going to be fun. You fucking kidding me? I'm a bank robber, not a web designer. So we'll go robbing soon. Uh, I'll find something. Just like the old days. <coughs> Alright, that's Lester. Y'all probably know him from the uh, other online videos I've done. Alright, do I have a car? Yes, I do. I was kind of worried. I was like, oh wait, where's my car? Here it is. So yeah, that is my boy Lester. <laughs> so now we're going to head to, I think, Suburban, and get ourselves some threads. I'll see y'all at Suburban. Okay, we're pulling up on Suburban right now. Yeah, that part like a pro. Ah, excuse me. I got this interview at this tech company. I'm thinking I need something, I don't know, geeky, youthful. Lost your job and the world's moved on, huh? That's too bad. I didn't lose my job. Of course. Got too old, got outsourced. Same thing happened to my dad. Now you gotta fit in with a different generation. Hmm? What about a vest and some cargo shorts? Alright. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is get the cargo shorts because 
They won't let you get them. I usually get the khaki, khaki. I'm sorry. <laughs> get the khaki shorts. And uh, this, I don't know. I I tend to go uh, more for this one. Dignity aside, I think that might just work. Good luck at the interview. Okay, yeah, let's get to the life of better offices. So this mission is kind of simple. You know, not too hard. You know, not too easy. Michael, I'm all dressed up. Now you want to run me through this thing? The prototype is somewhere in the Life Invader office. Find it and fit it with the device in your bag. They just gonna let me in? Why wouldn't they if you look the part? Hang around till someone opens the door and act entitled. Fine. Okay, I'll see y'all at the Life Invader offices. Look at that. It's working out a little bit better. There we go. Okay. Let's go up these stairs and meet some people. Hey. Hey. Oh, great. Uh, PM's preaching for more functionality. <laughs> but we are maxed. I mean, if anything, we have to strip features, especially if we plan on releasing a fully yeah. priced update a year later. Oh, my. You know, it's... Yeah, well, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? I mean, we're talking beta in Q4, maybe Q3. Look, milestones are one thing, but when design is changing its mind yeah. seemingly overnight, there's not much you can do about it. You Look, know what I'm saying? Uh, my union allocated smoke breaks about up, so... Wait a minute. Do I know you? Yeah, I think so. I, I tea temp, right? Yeah. You know, you gotta do something for me. Ah, uh, you gotta put it in a ticket. Uh, no. I'd like to keep this one out of the database, if you know what I mean. Alright, so we have made it inside the Life Invader offices. I'm turning consultant when we release. Consulting consulters. Oh, hi. Chill out on the beanbag. Marcus will be right out. Oh, um, I'm gonna take a normal chair. I have a terrible back. <laughs> Here you go. If you guys let me use the OS I requested, this wouldn't be a problem. This is a filthy <laughs> hard drive, bro. Uh, got any antivirus software? I think right. so. Behind this junk on the left. Clicked an NSFW link, bro. Bit me on the ass. Yeah, not safe for work, huh? You know, my son's computer runs into the same kind of problems. I'll close the pop-ups, see what I can do. Okay, we got some space. I'll try to boot up this antivirus. Scanning. Wow. Your job is actually kind of stressful too, ain't it? And that should do it. Why don't you try and keep things strictly safe for work from now on? <laughs> hey, have you seen the prototype in the demo room? When Norris announces it at the keynote, minds are gonna blow. Yes, they are. When we get all their movements, we know everything. That's so cool. <laughs> It's Jane Orr's right there. Without the little guys. Bye now. <laughs> sit, 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 sit. Book bag, dig fast. Ow! Come on, you're gonna have to learn the foot bag if you want to get a job here, okay? Follow me. Okay. Oh. Some a hole drank my effing head milk. There was a totally non passive aggressive note on it. Hold on, I'll buzz you out. All the way around. Why don't you 
one, mate. Hey, Michael, hold on, hold on. Don't! I don't ya! Lester, the thing's in the prototype. I'm going home to watch the keynote. Teabag time, my friend! Lester, did you hear me? Are you playing that game? Yeah, yeah, sorry, the phone is rigged. Now, what's your problem? You don't like shooters? They're all the same. Besides, you know me. I'm a movie guy. Classic Vinewood. Classic Vinewood ended 30 years ago. Now it's just superheroes, romantic comedies, and remakes, none of which interest me. Hey, I believe this country can still make interesting movies. There's no better way to define American life than a two-hour plot in which the hero looks good and defeats evil. Now, whatever you say, enjoy yesterday. Anyway, just call the device after he's unveiled it, and then we'll talk. Yeah. That's more like it. <laughs> oh my god, you guys are so lame! No! I'm watching Fame or Shame! Fucking tits! Jim's on fire! Funny how she doesn't even question the outfit Michael's wearing right now. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Jay Norris to the stage. Hey, this company has come a long way since we started it in my parents' pool house in East Carowind. Today, you're about to witness a new phase. Full-on, weapons-grade, red alert, world domination! We have put a billion people's private data in the public domain, and we have milked every penny we could in the process. And we have one of the youngest workforces in the world. An average age of only 14.4 years? That's not just impressive, it's revolutionary! Yay. Yay. Today, today, right here, <laughs> we're about to make the next step. Prepare to witness the, the future. future. The Life Invader mobile device. Yes, we've invented something no one else has ever thought of. A smart oh. Hold on a second. I think someone's trying to talk with me. Hello? Oh! Get ah. Oh, Jesus! Whoa! No, 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 no. Whoa! Michael's probably thinking, did that just happen? Whatever, 50% doesn't really bother me any. Alright. <laughs> Lester! That was heavy! Are you watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till close. Alright. Hey, about that other thing. You know the score. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Put on a suit, look somewhat professional, and meet me at my warehouse off the LS freeway. Oh, uh, and I'm about to email you a link for the exchange. You can put in some trades of your own. Uh, I'm trying to stay off the day trading. Uh, but maybe I'll take a look. All right. So instead of going to Lester's mission, the next one, we're going to do Franklin's mission for him. So let's switch to Franklin. Alright, so we are at Franklin right now. We're gonna be doing the next mission. I think I have an idea of what this mission is. Alright, so let's head in. Time switch. Hello, prayers have been answered well. Hello. I don't wanna know. Franklin! What the fuck? I mean, what the hell going on here? Wait a minute, Franklin, what are you doing here? I live here. This half my house, too. So you say? Anyway, Magenta is reinvigorating my femininity. So make yourself scarce, boy. Go. Go. With pleasure. Go. Goodness. And stay out of trouble! 
Yeah, yeah. Bitch, you ain't no more of a man than me. I hear that. Gangsta shit, nigga. Look, Look who's the camera. What's up, What's it with it, man? Oh, no, no. Show some respect here, nigga. The man, they couldn't hold down his back. Come on now. Damn, man. I gotta spend my day with another middle-aged fool trying to recapture his youth. What this fool just say? I missed you, dawg. Oh, oh. You missed me, huh? Nah, I ain't missed you. Your ass could've stayed gone for good. So I fucked your girl, mm -hmm. mugged your moms, mm -hmm. and better yet, I ain't thought about your ass in years. Ha ha. You got jokes now, huh? Hey, but I see you doing well for yourself. Check that on out. Shit, I'm doing just fine. That's what I hear. But I know some sweet boys up in the pen that got bigger balls than you. Well, you been doing your time looking at sweet boy balls? Oh. Yeah, it's good to have confirmation. This funny fuck. Why you keep hanging around this clown, L? Shake this fool, we man. We from the same set, Stretch. Why, why y'all niggas can't get along? Y'all been doing this shit for years, man. You know what, dawg? It's good you back home. Glad you here. Missed you, boy. Damn, you definitely got hit up inside. Hit up? Hey, hey. Yo, motherfucker, I know little niggas like you been turned out on the daily. Talking about being hit up, nigga, I swear, man. You ain't got no motherfucking respect. Motherfucker, I got respect for reality. Reality? All right. All right, you keep thinking that. Just keep thinking that, nigga. Shit, you gonna get yours. Fuck you. Oh, I swear, man. Whoa, come on, whoa, whoa, man. Cool what out. Fuck, Chill, man? man. This motherfucker get on my goddamn nerves. The nigga get on my nerves, too, man. What's part of the nigga charm, man. F, come on, man. Let's just bust a move, man. You gonna drive or what, Bill? Drive where? Pick up this heat, nigga. Why? Business, nigga. Real business. Come on, girl. Y'all niggas act like girls. Shit. Not me. Shit. Ammunition. Come on. Let's go. You know, when I went away, you punks was little homies, and I was a big homie. Now I'm out, and you little homies is big homies. But you still gotta respect. Man, what the fuck this nigga talking about? We all big homies, but he bigger, right? Exactly. Man, that's some fucking pyramid scheme bullshit. Pyramids is good, man. Illuminati Pharaoh shit. As soon as we get this shit, as soon as we get paid, homie. As soon as we get incarcerated, more likely. Ammunition. Armorer to the stars. Hey, what's up, man? Firing range is in the back, and all our weapons are customizable. Oh, hell yeah. You can trick your blam blam out up in here. Quit all that. Just straight up artillery, man, all right? Don't y'all shut the fuck up. I got this, you clowns. All right, homie, get your shotgun with the flashlight modification. Okay. How the fuck am I the only one buying this? Because we got sheets, homie. Now shut the fuck up and come on. Take us down to that one spot where the base heads be taking their cans at. You know, old friends in La Puerta. You got some cans or some shit I don't know about? Nah, homie. We got ourselves a drug deal. Why do I get the feeling this gonna be one of them deals gone wrong type situation? Now, see, that's that negative attitude Lamar was telling me about, nigga. You ain't getting nowhere thinking like that. The power of positive bullshit. You ought to be clenching your motherfucking vagina muscles with my aunt, nigga. After his bid, it probably needs tightening up. This ain't new age shit. It's fact. You get what you get, fool. You've been getting dick, but you ain't giving it, huh? Some Mark talk like that to an OG? <laughs> CGF has changed, man. No wonder the hood is so lame right now. Speaking of change, Lamar's been meaning to talk to you, homie. Nah, nah, not now, homie. What's happening? It's nothing, my nigga, nothing, you know? Just some ideas, that's all. Man, ideas ain't your strong suit, so put it on me. It's nothing real, homie. When it's something real, we'll talk. Bullshit, man. It's realer than this crap. Hey, this we meet them here. One of my favorite missions. I don't, know, I don't know why. It's just something about it, you know. Man, how'd you find this place? The homie set it up. It's the kind of spot where we ain't gonna be disturbed. That's what the fuck worries me. I'm more of a hide in the plain sight type of nigga. No, you more of a punk bitch type nigga. Ha ha ha! 
What's up, up fool? fool? What up, we got it? that shit, nigga, with a paper hat. Nigga, I'm talking about Buku Bill. Lamar yeah. Davis. <laughs> What's up, boy? Everything cool? Yeah. Come on, man. What the fuck, man? You was just kidnapping this nigga. Oh, oh come, come on, y'all. Don't real yeah. recognize real. D, my nigga, just got out crossing lines, did some time with some of your folks. Hey, look, look, look. This ain't about you, what? man. What? You know these niggas dumb. Yo, what fuck, the fuck duh. this trick talking about, man? Yeah, What's yeah, that? yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody see, see, see. On us? They put a nigga on TV, man, about some gang intervention shit. Hey, this ain't the police, dog. This some ballers bullshit. Nigga, that's some bullshit. Fuck you. What's up with hey, that? Hey, set up, nigga. This shit fucked fuck up. Fuck you, nigga. Fuck 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 shit. Oh, bitch ass ballers. Yeah, let's do this. We doing this or what? Come on. What kind of dumb motherfucker would trust that motherfucker? It look good on papers, all I'm gonna say. Cover me, homie. I'm gonna hit this. Ah! Oh, you see that shit? You going first next time, no fool. Shit, nigga, then we all be dead. Not me, nigga. Your homie's dead. Ah! Ah! You handled that fool. Yeah, and I'd handle him again. Many times does it take shit. Man, I don't want your clumsy ass falling down these stairs, fool. They was a safety hazard before blood got spilled all over the place. Slow motion is gonna come in handy. Easy fool! This ain't got nothing to do with me, homie. What the cops care about us getting away? It might not come up here. Man, what a roll is that? Now take us somewhere where we can get it in, homie. Oh, man, we going back to my crib, man, and you can walk from there. Let's go. 
Hey, what the hell you walked me into back there? Shit, man, you're the one popped his ass. I did the necessary. Yeah, thank you for that, dawg. This all on you, LD, lanky dumbass. Me? Hey, I ain't know the fools was gonna roll on us. If you started something with the ballers, shit, I don't care if you CGF for life, man. You done. Done, you dig? Actually, we ain't CGL for life, because all that means is we giving you money for nothing. We got our own shit now, homie. Foreign gangsters. Oh, no, nah, no. Nah, he don't mean that, low. F just talking out the side of his neck. I'm going to reach cross lines, all right? Conversate with the purple homies. Yeah, yeah. That's a good idea, man. Smart shit. Yeah, back in. Because we're cool like that. Here we are, man. You going to hang with your auntie while the men break it off. Shut the fuck up. Hell no, nah, nigga. You sounding more and more like a snee eye yes every day. Hell no, nah, yeah. nigga. I sound like somebody trying to make some paper and not get killed. He's a hook ass nigga. I told nigga, you. Nigga, go toss a salad, stretch mark ass bitch. Fucking busted. <sighs> Let's see what we got. Hey, not bad. Unmarked. Headshots. Accuracy. And we were getting headshots like do -do 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 every time. All right. So I think the next mission is probably going to be Michael's mission. Uh, something about his family. So yeah, let's uh, get to Michael. Don't touch me! Oh, you don't have to call to tell me that. Not you, the Dieter Sachs door detective. There's been a misunderstanding. I need you to help clear it up. All right, should we help Amanda? I'm going to help her. Oh, now you want me. All right, I'm coming. The one phone call rule is for real policemen. Turn the music off real quick. I not expect that to come, so music's on because I was literally driving up to the place. So let's uh help Amanda, I guess. You know how much this car costs? Judging? No, not at all. Get rid of the car, Michael. It can't stay in the driveway. Oh, and yeah. Thank you. Mission pass. Oh, the the guy who pays the bills is here. The next person is in there for some reason, so we're gonna like drive off and then come back. Who's there? Yeah, who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. <laughs> oh, I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. What you do's your business, bro. Anyway, 
Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintegrated my team in Burundi after the design got signed off. And now, my shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work. And I thought maybe you could provide. I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down, aren't I? I guess you are. Hey, I'll be in touch if anything comes up. Okay. So now we're going to be doing the next mission. Daddy's old girl. You don't love me. You love what I represent. You love being the. Hey, do you even have a penis? Or are you one of those hermaphrodites born without genitals? Tricks up our sleeves, huh? <laughs> Same. <laughs> Just a nightclub singer with a broken heart. I still you love you. Hold on to yourself. You're in over your head and you're up there. Damn. Jimmy! God damn it. The fuck you doing? Nothing. Really? Cause I keep hearing a math for that. This a cop that. Go away. What? You know, go watch your linear entertainment. Go watch porn. Just go away. Shit. Fuck you. What the <laughs> fuck? You disrespectful little asshole. I can't believe you did that. That's my TV. You don't talk to me like that. I can't believe you. Mom was right about you. You don't know any better, and you can't help it. But you're an asshole. Yeah. Well, why don't you do something then? Besides just stand there. Why don't you hit me? Is that what you want, to be hit by your son? Yeah. No. I just want you to do something. Besides, sit there, eating. Yeah, great. <laughs> Thanks for the fucking guidance, Dad. It means a lot. Wait. I'm just trying to help you. Yeah. Well, nothing says I love you like smashing my fucking TV. Nothing at all. I'm sorry. I just wish we could do things together. Hey, what things? I don't know. Uh, go for walks. Play ball. You know I have bad glands. Yeah. Bike ride, then. Bike ride? You want to go on a fucking bike ride? Fine, fine, let's go on a fucking bike ride. We'll take a bike ride along Vespucci Beach, and I'll show you just what you want to see. Okay, let's do this. This day was going so well until you showed up, you know that? <gasps> you know, you're lucky to even be allowed out of the house after that boat stunt. What's the big deal? If anything goes wrong, you can just fake your death and start all over. How am I meant to develop my own moral sensibilities when yours are so unbelievably fuck-based? Don't push me. Seriously, some guys borrow your bow. Borrow? You were hiding in the head crying kidnapped. They just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right, they fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me. But I didn't expect or want them to get killed. You think I'm going to let some guys ride off with my son? Look, I knew you... Oh, Watch I mean... it! Oh, that was Sorry pretty epic. That. that was pretty epic. I knew you were a bad guy. But... Oh, a bad guy. A crook, a killer, a thief, a liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another. Right? It's just... What? <sighs> I always thought I was the good guy. God help the more bad that your generation have left us if you're the good guy. Yeah. Anyway, I always knew you were the kind of person who didn't let other people get in the way, but I hadn't, like, seen that happen before. Yeah, well, that's me, Jim. And I've been trying my best to get things under control for the last ten years, but that was an extreme fucking situation, and I had to act. A normal person wouldn't have done that. Yeah, well, I had to. To protect you. Yeah, keep telling yourself that when you see their faces every time you close your eyes. Here we are at the bike rental place. Please don't shoot the bike rental guy out of like force of habit. Little Easter egg right here. Hey, you. That guy's shirt has John on it. 
Why you bumping into me? Oh, obviously. I'll take this one. I don't want to hit anybody. Oh, the grass. That's better. No me digas! Chomingo! Hey! That's so far so good. All the way down. Oh! I hate that. Down the straight and narrow down this pier. Is this for me? Oh, what the fight? Damn! They're staying at the beach soon. Listen, I gotta go. I've been trying to get some RR. Traffic. Looks like you're buying your own TV. You know, this is real nice, Dad. Bonding, good times. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving it my best shot. Come on, we're having fun, right? You wouldn't know fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford so that thugs break in our house. Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht. Well, that's just because she's too busy getting fucked by dudes to get on TV. You don't talk about your sister that way. Well, I'm sorry, but it's true. I mean, according to her Life Invader page, she's hanging out with producers and porno guys this afternoon. What are you talking about? Actually, it's all happening right out there. What? That boat that makes yours look like a refugee raft? You know the kind of boat. The one that makes a young, impressionable girl drop her pants and spread her legs. This is the reason you brought me here, isn't it? You fuck. Ah! Dad, wait! <laughs> All right, let's see. We gotta go as fast as we can. That music right there. That's another nostalgic moment. You know, I don't know what it is. It's just nice, you know? I miss the old days of just, just story mode and linear GTA Online, you know? Not the full on GTA Online and linear story mode. It's kind of like flip flop, you know? Yeah, you're embarrassing her, dude. They're shooting porno here. They shoot porno all over town. Mom rented our house to them last summer. That was what? Your house? Yeah. Man, you gotta kill her bad, Mr. <laughs> Isn't it awesome? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Those walls can talk. You think I do it? Hey. No. Hey. Shit, hey, cool, Daddy. man. <laughs> hey, what are you doing? Oh, oh, hey. Oh, oh, man. I oh, like that. What's the problem? You're such a jerk. Come on. Dad, you dumbass. These guys are serious. Yeah, well, so am I. Fuck this scene of my fucking boat. Oh, motherfuckers! Get on! Now! I'm about to skin you alive! God damn it! Go! Can you do it to get this done, like, really fast? Yeah, this is probably a gun right Shit! They're coming after us! Daddy, damn. you just killed him! Maybe he's just injured! All right! Oh, yeah, he's injured, all right! All right. Asshole, 
okay? He smashed my TV and he took me to the beach. The beach with my skin. So what, you send him out to spoil my day too? I didn't know that he was gonna come get you. I just told him where you were. You know, he got that crazy look in his eyes, you know, like he gets sometimes and he just went. I'm getting a cab. I'm coming with you. How about I just drive us home? You ruined my life. <laughs> Get those two gunshot wounds right below. Like right beside each other. Like even. Alright, let's see. Hey, not bad. Faster than a fish. Stabilizer. Faster speed. Hey, not bad. Alright. Anyways guys, I think that's where I'm going to leave it off today. We got uh, a couple missions done. We did Lush's mission, we did Franklin's mission, and we did Michael's mission. The next episode, I think we are planning the big heist. I'm not going to say what it is. You probably, you guys already know. GT5 a pretty big game. But yeah, so anyways guys, thank you guys for watching. Well, guys, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, share this video, all your friends, and this video more in the future. Hit that post notifications, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care now. Bye.